Yeah. Um, so I, I had the uh, I had the pleasure of listening to both Mike and uh, Mike and Mark speak and um, I'm really happy to see that everybody's in, um, going to be presenting projects uh, that are based on Politea. When we originally uh, came up with Politea, it was based on the idea that if we're going to be a self-governing uh, uh, project and we're going to be serious about it, we need something more serious than just a website. And you know, if you're if you're here, you probably realize that we built that system, which is basically it's better than a website. It's anchored into a blockchain, and all, all of the data that goes in is accountable. Rather than just settling for you know the ability to say, look, something's on a website, somebody published it. What we've decided to do is we've decided to sort of turn that on its head and go, everything that goes into the system can be accounted for, and that's both. Well, it's, it's a question of who said what, when, and by combining those three elements, we have an extremely generic system that can be used for all kinds of applications outside of the governance of the grid. And we were aimed at Politea because we felt that it was it was in the historical context. I know that might be boring to some, but Politea means the machinery of the state, and that's really what we're trying to build here. We're trying to be more accountable more transparent and just better than existing systems. Rather than just going, ah, whatever, we can just put it on a website and roll with it. We're holding ourselves and the project to a higher standard. And our hope is that other projects besides Decred can uh, obtain utility from this. And I mean that both in the context of other currency projects, private organizations, and even government. And my hope is, is that you know, by continuing this process and by the competitors here uh, proposing their ideas and ultimately some winning the contest, that we will move the peg forward collectively for accountability and transparency in you know in the context of photography. We've got a long ways to go, but in the very near future here, I technically will not be project lead and. That you know the uh, the sovereignty that we've always intended for the stakeholders to have in terms of making more project scale decisions is going to be vested in the stakeholders directly and made transparent to all the users via Politea. I'm really looking forward to that point because I'll, I'll you, when you have, it's it's a heavy crown. I'm I'm glad to have it lightened by the many hands of the stakeholders. Further, um, we're going to be having uh, <clears throat> we're going to be having a new roadmap here in the very near future. Uh, apologies for the delays. I've had personal changes in my life. I now have a young a, a young a young baby in the house, and so I'm a little bit behind. Um, the roadmap will outline exactly how we're going to use tools like Politea to decentralize major decision making, and that includes on-chain transactions, in that um, ultimately the funds that are available from the development organization, which is something like over 40,000, excuse me, over 400,000 decred, will be placed in the control of the share of the, not shareholders, excuse me, stakeholders. I'm really excited about this, and I expect a lot of our stakeholders are as well, and anyone who's, uh, you know, who's just here and just wants to see it happen, I hope, I hope you uh, derive some entertainment process as well. I'm sure there will be some hiccups along the way, and it will make for an interesting process. I'd like to thank Marco for his excellent dev work and making a point to hack this stuff out when it really doesn't exist. It's just an idea that's being kicked back and forth between me and Marco and a handful of other people. We do have a number of payment integrations coming up that I'm looking forward to. They're going to be, uh, it's going to really increase the fungibility of Decred so that you can spend the places, merchants can accept it. And uh, I think we've got a lot of exciting stuff that's going to be coming up on the roadmap here, um, such as uh, the, the aforementioned decentralized autonomous entities that Marco has spoken about on occasion. I won't, I won't spoil the rest of the roadmap, but um, it will be arriving next week.